looking back at John's Breach on Sunday, I've been getting quite excited. I remembered some of the old prayers I used to have, some of the people I used to pray for. And I used to pray for them a lot more regularly than I do now. I used to ask that God would meet them where they are and really touch them. And I kind of laid them down. But I've been reminded with John's preach that actually I need to lift them up again. I need to give them back and say, God, you promised that you're going to meet these people. I've seen you meet people in so many different ways, in so many different situations. And so I'm going to lift these people up again to you. And I've started to do it and I'm getting excited about what God's going to do. And I'm hoping that for you as well, you've had the same sort of response. That as the week has started, you've had new people, new situations new things laid on your heart that actually you'd laid down and you'd forgotten but God's just started to to show them again and say what about this prayer what about this promise what about this situation and hopefully you're going to start praying into them I'm praying for you as much as for me that we start to get a new excitement about the old prayers that we've we've laid down and we start to press in and say God I'm going to keep praying for this because I know you're a God who keeps your promises and I know you've promised for this situation to change stay in that place read through his promises if you're not feeling that excitement read through the things that god has already done in your life if you've kept a journal or a notebook of things he's changed and get excited and hopefully by the end of the week we'll have some amazing testimonies of people seeing situations change that haven't changed in so long but after this week of praying in god stepped in as he always does and has changed the situation have a grand day